Okay. So, I'm here with future superstar Andy Vences. Um, Andy, first off, when might you be back in the ring? Uh, I'm looking to be back in the ring uh, January 24th at uh, Cash Creek Casino. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm set to be on the card, so we're just looking forward to that and just uh, staying in shape, staying ready. Any rumored fighters or anything that you might want to throw out there or no opponent yet? Uh, yeah, actually, we're looking to get at the opponent. Uh, we're looking to fight... Uh, I think his name's uh, Gallardos. He's the guy that uh, he got a knockout win over uh, Luis Ambrosio. So um, I'm looking to fight him and hopefully uh, just, you know, to have a fight with him and just, you know, stop him in his tracks. You know, a lot of people are giving him a lot of credit um, because he's gotten a couple wins and draws over some fighters. So um, I'm looking to put an end to his, uh, his pace that he has going for himself. Would that be a little bit of a grudge match since I believe Luis Ambrosio would be uh, like kind of a stable mate? Wasn't he with Herb Stone? So that would be kind of like a rebuttal? Yeah, no, it wouldn't be a grudge match at all or, or, or anything like that. It's just um, simply just outbox him and outsmart the guy. I mean, it, there's nothing special about him. So we're just going to show that on fight night. Uh, he's, an ever, he's an average fighter. He doesn't deserve to be there. And we're just going to get ready to show everybody, you know, how, how it's done, you know? You've had multiple Fox Sports 1 fights. How close are you to the top 10 in the 130-pound division? Uh, to be honest, I don't know. I, I, I know I've had multiple fights on Fox Sports 1. Um, I'm looking for a big year coming up. I, I hope to be fighting eight rounds soon. Um, as soon as I get a couple sixes in, uh, just, just jump to eight rounds, and I'm hoping that if everything goes good, if I don't injure myself, that by the end of the year I can... I can uh, hopefully be fighting 10 rounds um, but we all got to see how it goes as long as there's no injuries every fight goes good no cuts happen I mean there's a lot of things that can take place to hold me back but if everything goes good uh, it should, we should be it should, we should be set for a big year coming up okay and uh, final question will you headline a card in San Jose 2015 uh, prob probably not Ma maybe not um, it just all depends on my performances and in 2015 and uh, just 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 how each fight goes um, I just got to shine fight nights every fight night I got to shine so I'm just gonna train real hard uh, working good with coach Gabe uh, we're just we're just we're just a good good team great team I don't see I don't see anybody stopping us right now so we're just gonna keep focused and just follow the road that's guided for us and we're just gonna take it to all these guys